Hi guys, welcome to this session on Microsoft Word. In this module, I want to have a look at how you can do a mail merge into a PDF document. So first of all, I've got a blank document here, and now I need to go onto the mailings tab and then start the mail merge process. So start mail merge, a letter I want, select recipients. I'm going to pick a list I've already got. And the one I've got is in an access database. So I'll just go into my examples folder, access company records. And the table where the details are is that one, address details. Now you can insert an address block. So the mail merge process is the same. I'll click on view results so you can see that. Um, the uh, title, first name, surname, and then you do your, your text. So I've got some auto text, so I'll just put that in there. Pretend that's your letter. So the process then is to finish and merge as you would normally do. Finish, in, I always select this option. You can just print it straight, but then you don't get the option to do a PDF. So this is the option. I'm gonna merge all records. Now this is letters two. What you need to do here is save this. So normally I would say to people, you don't need to save this because this is just like the printout. But for your reference, if I just come down, you can see for each record in the database, there is a letter, but they are all still in Word. So what you need to do is just simply save this document as a PDF. File, save as, Give it a name, um, PDF, and change this to save as a PDF. Save that, and then th this file is now converted into a PDF. So I've got the Adobe Acrobat Reader opening up, and you can see there is a PDF letter for each person. So you don't need to have an add-in there's lots of videos about where there is a pdf add-in tool now you can use that or you can download that some of them are free but word has the functionality to save so does excel save documents as pdf so the whole process is quite seamless and no need to add anything any extra software in you can still achieve the same with the pdf reader that we just saw so that's all I want to talk about in this little session. So I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for your time.